The first lady and wife of vice presidential nominee Tim Walls were also in mid-Michigan today. Jill Biden and Gwen Walls stopped in Bay City for lunch to discuss what's at stake in this year's election. TV5's James Felton was at the Women for Harris Walls event, and he joins us with why they're warning against another Trump presidency. James? Yeah, that's right. They were here in Bay City at this place called My Table behind me. They wrapped up about an hour ago their comments. Now, the First Lady, Dr. Jill Biden, and Gwen Walls, wife of vice presidential candidate Tim Walls, stopped here at My Table in downtown Bay City. During their remarks to the enthusiastic crowd, they thanked volunteers for their hard work on the Harris Walls ticket. Biden also said that Vice President Harris will fight for the middle class telling us that Harris has spent her career fighting for the people and that as president, she'll make life a little easier for families across the country. Lower costs on housing, food and prescriptions and strengthening Social Security and Medicare and also protecting a women's right to make her own health care decisions. And Mrs. Walls called on Michiganders to turn the page on Donald Trump. She said that for nine years, we've suffered through the Trump show, sowing chaos and division, lying to our faces and making everything about himself. She went on to say that Trump, Vance and MAGA Republicans are fighting for themselves and what they offer with their 20, Project 2025 agenda, no one is asking for. Trump's agenda threatens fertility treatments. And this is personal. Tim and I were only able to start a family because we had access to fertility treatments. And it was hard, really hard. But it was so worth it. We cannot fathom anyone being denied the joys of parenthood. President Harris will proudly sign a national law to re restore reproductive freedom to every woman in every state in our country. And the pair were in Traverse City this morning and this evening they are scheduled to be in Wisconsin. Reporting in Bay City, James Felton, TV5, back to you.